Hey guys, Gun Wild here. Um, this is going to be a video, video response to uh, Ebomi and some of the other videos that are out there about the perfect prepping rifle. Uh, Ebomi did a fantastic video showing a low budget AR build, which is awesome. I, I think that is such a fantastic choice for um, a prepping rifle. You can hunt with it, you can defend your family and yourself with it. Um, and there have been others out there that have made video responses showing like uh, 8Ks and, and 22s and stuff like that which are also great choices and yes I am one of those people that believe that you can defend yourself with a 22 but anyway um, my choice and this is an inexpensive choice and it's the high point 995TS the little 9 millimeter um, carbine rifle just uh, an awesome awesome rifle these things I got this one on sale for $2.99 very low cost but it's built like a tank and it runs and runs and runs it's kinda like an AK this thing will run fantastic dirty matter of fact I've put roughly so far about 700 rounds through this um, have not cleaned it yet with the exception of um, cleaning it when I brought it home, you know, take all the, the factory lube off of it and, and, you know, put my own lube on there. But so far, I have not cleaned this since the day I brought it home. And uh, it's working great. No malfunctions. As a matter of fact, I want to um, kind of give it a little torture test to see how long it'll go before I do have any kind of failure but so far running like a tank. Um, like I said, it's a nine millimeter, very popular round. Um, I think it would be fairly easy to find ammo for this um, if you're ever in like an SHTF situation. Um, I watched Alaric 357's video uh, and he was talking about his new AR. He wants to go out and shoot it, but he's having a difficult time finding ammo for it right now. I think people are already starting to freak out about the election and buying up all the ammo. Um, kind of like what happened four years ago. But uh, I think a 9 mil would be easy to find. And this is, a, like I said, it's an inexpensive rifle, 300 bucks, built like a tank. It runs fantastic. Um, nine millimeter you can use for self-defense you can use it for hunting um, I'm I've never hunted a day in my life but I'm sure you could take down a, a good size animal with a nine millimeter you know like a 22 you can take out small game I'm sure this will work for something a little larger um, I don't know if it would take down a deer or whatever but you know you could definitely hunt with it and defend yourself and your family with it. So this is uh, my two cents on the uh, the, the prepping rifle. Um, and you may notice that it looks a little different than the other 995 TSs. It's because I've removed the iron sights. I had a hard time seeing through the peep sights that were on it, so I put a red dot. Um, but the only downfall to this firearm, in my opinion, is 10 round magazine. That's it. Comes with 10 rounder. This, this is the factory mag. I have four of these. Um, now there are, there is an aftermarket magazine out there made by Pro Mag, I believe. But everything I've heard about them, all the reviews I've seen about them, nobody's been happy with them. You know, it's kind of hit or miss. They work or they don't. Um, I gotta tell you, I I did purchase one and didn't even run any any uh, ammo through it because the the second I popped it into the uh, the gun I felt how sloppy and loose it was in the gun and I didn't even want to try it I imme immediately sent it back to uh, to the place I bought it from to where the the factory mags just snap in there and they're in there nice and solid there's just no concern so um, the 10 round magazine is in my opinion the the downfall of this rifle 
as far as using it for uh, prepping or whatever if you needed more than 10 rounds at a time. But other than that, in my opinion, this is just a fantastic firearm um, to have in your, your preps. So anyway, that's my two cents, guys. Thanks for watching. Talk to you later. Goodbye.